Hi everyone. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to copy your Google Analytics tracking ID and paste it into your website. Now, in order to do this, you will have already created you, your Google Analytics tracking ID code and you need administrative access to your website. So you need to know the user ID and password in order to upload files to your website. If you don't have that kind of access, copy and paste this code into an email and email it to your IT person so they can paste it for you. So what I've done is I've logged into Google Analytics and I need to go to that tracking code that I created. So to find that code, I'm going to click on admin in the upper menu. So here's admin and from my accounts in the left hand column, I'm going to find the account that I created the, the tracking code with. In this case, LA testing. I'm going to go over to the next column, the property column, make sure I have the correct website, Libasys, and I'm going to go to tracking info. From here, I click tracking info and I select tracking code. And this will take me directly to the tracking code. And here it is. Everything in this little window here from this starting script tag down to this ending script tag is what I want to copy and then paste into my web pages HTML code. So the fastest way to copy is using your keyboard. You can do edit copy from the menu above or I can simply click on control C on my keyboard or command C if you're a Mac user. And now I have to open up my HTML page using some kind of editor, whether it's a text editor or something like Dreamweaver Composed or something like that. So I'm going to open up my web HTML file in my text editor. And here's my web page. This is all the HTML code that created my web page. Now I want to paste that tracking ID into the head of my website. So to do this, I have to find the ending head tag. Now, right now, it's pretty close to the top of the page. It's right here. But in some pages, you might have a lot of uh, script. You might have a lot of style information that pushes that code hundreds of lines down below, and it will be very difficult to find. The fastest way to find the head tag or the ending head tag is by using the built-in find feature. So click Control F on your keyboard or Command F if you're a Mac user. And this nice little field pops up top. This is the find field. So just type in the head tag or the ending head tag. So I'm typing uh, the caret slash head. And as I type, you notice it's starting to highlight the head tag or the ending head tag in yellow. Here it is. So I want to paste my code right above this ending head tag in my HTML field. So I'm going to click above it, add a couple of empty lines so I can see what I'm doing. And now I want to paste that tracking ID. I can either go edit and paste from the top menu here, or I can use a control, uh, control V on my keyboard or command V if I am a Mac user, so I paste it in with the control V and there's the code, the same exact code that I copied from my Google Analytics. Now I have to save this by either doing file save or control S or command S if I'm a Mac user. I've saved this change that I have made and now I have to upload it to my website. So I'm going to open up either Dreamweaver or in this case, Cyberduck, which is an FTP uh, program. You can also use FileZilla, Core FTP, anything like that. And now I have to upload this HTML file that I just changed and I just added the code to. I'm going to select it, click on Upload, and now it's going to upload to my website. Now I have to overwrite because I'm making a change. I want that change to appear whenever somebody goes into my website now. And if I want to take a look, I can now go over to see what my website looks like. So here's my website and the source code behind it is right here. Here's that script that I just added. So from now on, anybody who visits 
this particular page, I can get all kinds of statistics from their visit, from what browser they were using to visit my web page to where, what city they're from, things like that. So this is a great resource, and that is how you copy and paste your Google Analytics tracking ID into a web page. Thanks for watching.